Good day, Grade 9 learners! I am Teacher Christy, your Teacher Friendly. Join with me as we explore the beauty of technical drafting technology. Today, we're going to learn new things, but before that, let's have a quick recall on our past lesson. Are you ready? Choose the letter of your answer. Let's have first question. A drafting tool used for drawing horizontal lines. A. Compass B. T-square C. Triangle D. Scale Now what's your answer? Very good! It's letter B, T-square. Next one, drafting materials used for fastening the drawing paper on the drawing table. Is it A, compass, B, masking tape, C, divider, D, triangle? The answer is, very good, it's B, masking tape. Third one, the most popular type of measuring tools, usually 6 or 12 inches in length. Is it A, tape ruler, B, triangle, C, ruler, D, scale? Right, what's your guess? Very good! It's letter C. That's ruler. Fourth one. A measuring tool used to lay out an angle or an arc. Is it A. Compass B. Divider C. Protractor D. Tape Ruler The answer is... C. Protector. Very good. Fifth one. These are used for the purpose of measuring dimensions. A. Cutting tools. B. Measuring tools. C. Lining tools. Or D. Testing tools. Now what's your guess? Very good! It's letter B. These are measuring tools. Good job, learners! Did you get a perfect score? Very good! Now I'm sure you're now ready for our next topic for today. In connection to our past lesson, we're still going to tackle the different drafting tools and their function. Today, we're going to learn on the proper use of drawing tools and equipment. At the end of our lesson, you will be able to first differentiate the function of different drawing tools and equipment. Second, determine the proper usage of tools. And third one, demonstrate the different tools and equipment on your activity plate. I believe that you are all excited on how to use the different drafting tools and equipment. So ready yourselves, sit properly, and listen attentively. We are going to utilize some tools for today. We have our drafting table. On top of our drafting table, we can easily put our drawing paper here. Next is T-square. The function of this is to help us draw the horizontal lines. And of course, let's not forget to put drafting tape on each side of the paper. So in the video, um, we have our drawing paper. Now a line paper on parallel edge then fasten top two corners with strips of drafting tape. After this, make sure to place it on the side of the drawing table before starting to draw lines. Next.
next drafting tool is a parallel ruler. It's the same with D-square but the difference is that it doesn't have a T-shape on one side. As you can see, one of the drafting tools being utilized is pencil. Here, we are making our border for this drawing plate. There are different kinds of pencil. Pencil is the very important tool of a draftsman. Wooden pencil is very popular to everyone. Another one is mechanical pencil. It has different sizes of lead and much thinner. Another tool that we're going to use is a triangle ruler. This is a 45 by 45 triangle. The function of this is to help us draw a vertical line. To add, erasing shield is a great tool to use when we erase some parts of our drawing. With this, it can protect the other drawing parts in the plane. This will maintain the cleanliness of our output. Also, we can use a 30 by 60 triangle. Now, in our succeeding activity learners, we're going to learn and execute the different drawing tools. And with our next plates, with the use of this triangle rulers. For now, let's practice on how we can use it with our T-square. Now, here, we are going to make vertical, horizontal, and diagonal lines in this activity. The measurements are attached in our activity given. learners i believe that you learned a lot in today's lesson this time let's try to assess if you have understood our topic choose the letter of the answer and write this in your tla notebook let's have number one these allow erasers to be used through them to erase lines and text without removing lines close by which do not need to be erased. Letter A, compass. B, T-square. C, sharpener. D, erasing shield. Now, what's your guess? Very good. It's letter D, erasing shield. Second one, a drafting tool used for drawing horizontal lines. Is it A, compass, B, T-square, C, triangle, D, scale? Now, what's your answer? 
Very good. It's letter B, T square. How about the third one? A drafting tool used for drawing vertical lines. Is it A, compass, B, T square, C, triangle, D, scale? That's correct. The answer is letter C, triangle. How about this question? What is the common tool of every draftsman? Is it A, compass, B, pencil, C, triangle, or D, scale? All right. It's the pencil. Good job. The last one we have, how can we maintain the position of our drafting paper for the whole activity? Is it A, by putting a drafting tape? B, by securing a pen on the paper? Letter C, by putting glue on the side of the paper? Or letter D, none of the above? Alright, I believe all of you got the correct answer. Yes, that's correct. It's letter A, by putting a drafting tape. Did you get a perfect score? Good job! I hope you learned something on our lesson and in our demonstration. For our reminders, on our next activity, we're going to utilize other drafting tools. That's all for today, learners. Again, this is Teacher Christy, your teacher friendly. Bye-bye! See you next time!